For that new video, the federal raid of the Los Angeles mansion of hip-hop mogul Sean Diddy Combs, and cl claims from Combs associates that agents mistreated his sons. Senior investigative correspondent Aaron Katursky has the story. Good morning, Aaron. And George, good morning to you. After those dramatic raids last month, the mother of one of Diddy's sons says a lawyer is now investigating what she calls the use of excessive force. This morning, a new inside look at the raid last month on hip-hop mogul Sean Diddy Combs, who's now the subject of a federal human trafficking investigation. His ex-girlfriend, Misa Hilton, with whom he shares a son posting this video, edited and sped up, showing armored vehicles in the driveway of his Los Angeles estate and heavily armed agents from Homeland Security Investigations moving in, guns drawn. Two of Diddy's sons, Justin and Christian Combs, seen here detained and later released. It's protocol during searches, but Hilton posting the overzealous and overtly militarized force used against my sons Justin and Christian is deplorable. If these were the sons of a non-black celebrity, they would not have been handled with the same aggression. When law enforcement, especially federal law enforcement, goes in to execute a search warrant, they've done um, quite a bit of intelligence gathering prior to doing the entry. It may seem excessive, but it may have been exactly what is prescribed in their rules and procedures. Federal agents carried out a parallel search at Diddy's home in Miami. Law enforcement sources told ABC News they found guns in both locations and seized multiple electronic devices as federal prosecutors in New York worked to corroborate allegations of sexual assault and sex trafficking from several of Diddy's accusers. In November, singer Cassie Ventura settled a lawsuit accusing Combs of drugging her, raping her, and passing her off to others during their relationship. Music producer Rodney Jones is suing Combs, claiming he has evidence of sex, drugs, and weapons offenses. Combs has denied everything. His lawyer said he's innocent and will continue to fight every single day to clear his name. This could be a messy or drawn out or, or very complex investigation. You have famous individuals, you have many different people making many different allegations and also many different defenses. They're going to have to go through all this and identify what is real, what is not, and what can be proved. Now, Combs has not been charged with any crime, but these searches carried out in broad daylight are a sure sign that prosecutors are confident in the strength of the evidence and in the case they're apparently building against him, Gus. What a story. Okay, Aaron, thanks very much. All right, thank you, Aaron.